Hi guys, it's Anne here, and today's video is going to be an unboxing. Today I'm going to unbox the Tribe Beauty Box. So this is new to me. I've never had this beauty subscription before, but I was curious about it, so I wanted to try it and share it with you. For this video, I'm going to talk about what the box is all about at the beginning, then I will go into the unboxing, so if you just want to jump ahead, I'll put that timestamp down below, and at the very end, I will talk about the money, particularly the Canadian aspect of it, because I know my Canadian viewers, that's something that we're always curious about. I was interested in this box because the owner is actually Canadian, so the owner's name is Billy, um, oh, I've written it down here, but I can't read my handwriting. Balogan. I'm gonna put her name on the screen and she's only 24. She's originally from Nigeria, but she did, I think she lives here in Toronto now. She went to school here in Toronto, um, actually at University of Toronto. So I was intrigued to try the box for that reason. So um, I should mention that she is also black. So it's a black female owned company, which I thought was very cool. She also mentions in her little uh, overview that she wants to cater to all skin tones. The box also says it's looking at the next best thing. So I interpret that as there's not always going to be name brands that I might know of in the box, which I'm totally okay with. I kind of like that with subscription boxes, trying out different brands, trying out things that I don't know anything about. They also say on their website that they're focusing on woman owned and indie brands as well in the box. So I think that's really cool. And in the box, you get five plus full-size products worth $125 or more. And then they try and do like a full range of products. So they try and do something for face, something for skin, something for eyes, something for lip, and like a tool. It's like a brush or something. I'm actually really surprised I got this box. This, I think, is the December, January box. Like I just ordered this and they shipped it to me like incredibly quickly. So I did quickly go on YouTube and saw a few people post a December, January box like three weeks ago um, and a couple about a week ago. So I didn't actually look at their video so I don't know what they got in it, but I just saw their like headers. <laughs> so it's like, okay, I think, I think this is the December, January box. I'll check out their videos and just double check that, you know, I think, I don't, I don't know how, again, I don't know the variety. So that's the other thing, I don't know if it's like BoxyCharm or um, Top Box where you get a mix, or if it's like, um, I'm trying to think of, I think it's like the Boxy Premium where everybody gets the same thing. Anyway, let's get into the unboxing. So it comes in this pink mailer. Um, I cut it open because I thought there was a box on the inside because it says Try Beauty Box. But when I opened it, I saw a product on the top and I'm like, oh, I don't think there's actually a box. So this is an example of one of those, it says Beauty Box, but it comes in a bag. Kind of like um, the Lucky Bag comes in a box. It's the opposite. Anyway, so I do know the brand of the first product, but I don't know what it actually is. So the first product is the Avant Hyaluronic Vitamin C Lycatin? Lycatin? Oh my gosh. Maris Aqua Jojoba Oil. That's a lot of words. Let's see, what does it say here? Sorry, Supreme Hyaluronic Acid Antioxidizing Duo Moisturizer. Okay, it's a moisturizer. I'm assuming apply to the morning and evening um, after cleansing and applying your serum. I've seen other people get this brand and I'm pretty sure, again, I'll do all the money totals at the end. Um, I'm pretty sure this is one of those brands that this is like valued at like $100 or something stupid like that. I can't remember if I've ever gotten anything from this brand. I don't think I have. I could be wrong, but I have seen other people get this. So I am curious to try this, but I'm also curious, <laughs> I need to do some investigation as to why is this brand so stupidly priced? <laughs> like why is it priced so high? I think I see a lip product here. Yes, so this is the, oh, it says Brenda, Dylan, and Kelly. I just read Brenda, Dylan, Kelly. I know what that is, Beverly Hills 90210. Um, so this is Sola Look. It says Brenda, Dylan, Kelly. Oh, there it is, there's the Beverly Hills 901. So, see, Brenda, Dylan, Kelly. Don't, don't even just say, see the 90210. It's funny how that it is. Anyway. It's a lip cream. Looks like it's kind of a red color. The packaging is very similar to without its shape, but the, the two-tone. Um, I know Huda Beauty has packaging like this and House Labs has packaging like this. Let's do a swatch. It's a very deep red. It's a lip cream, but I don't know if it's like drying. I think when like with a lip cream, it means it's not going to dry down. 
interesting color for me. It's a deep sort of orangey red. I don't think I have anything exactly quite like this, like as deep as this. Um, I do have some colors that are similar, but this one's actually pretty deep. So excited to try that out. Trying to avoid the big thing. <laughs> take some, oh, there's the card. So don't look at the card. I don't want to look at the card just in case it spoils it. Okay, Masquerade. So I've had these before. This is a Masquerade uh, face mask. This is the Hydrating Facial Sheet Mask. So I think I'm going to like this. This is the, it says Beauty Restore, Restore, Nourish, and Relax. I've had mixed, mixed feelings about the Masquerade masks. I think, again, they're another sort of overpriced product. And some of them are good, some of them are not so good. Oh, nice. Yay. I'm kind of excited about this because I've never tried one of these before. This is the Balm. Uh, down boy shadow and blush I don't know if it just it's a sh it's a blush um, so this is the outer packaging I've always wanted to try more of the balm stuff it's now in Chopper's Drug Mart so I think I will Ooh, and it looks like a nice color it is pink but it's fairly pale like a fairly light pink like soft let's try and give it a little swatchy swatch here what does it say so many men so little time ha <laughs> ha this will be interesting. I don't think I have any blushes like this either. Um, and it's a matte, a matte blush. So hopefully you can see it there on the side of my hand. And then the big thing, that's one, two, three, four items. So this will be the fifth item. Pink package. It is the Poppy, I think. I think that's what it says, Poppy. 12 color pressed pigment palette in neon drip so this looks interesting because it's going to be something that's different from anything i have it says create that perfect bold glam with mattes and shimmers from the neon drip palette these 12 vibrant and super blendable pressed pigments will make you look hotter than ever i kind of like how this is very reminiscent of this even though the colors don't go together um i think neon is very nano 2 and Ooh, ooh, ooh! i quite like this I'm, I'm really intrigued. I don't think it's gonna really translate on camera. Oh, there's, there's my camera, speaking of camera. I'll try and put a photo in because yeah, this is not, the camera's not picking this up. Like this color is so vibrant. I'm gonna try and put in a photo because I think a photo might be better. And I'll put in a photo of swatches as well. Um, Cause I wanna take a picture of it while it's like fresh. It looks really pretty. Um, yeah, like this, <laughs> this green, slimy. Wow, I don't know, I'm gonna, play with it but I don't know if that's a color I'm ever ever gonna use but I'm really liking like the pinks and the purples and like yeah I'm excited to give this a go there's one more item in here so the last item in here is the Amon perfect eye pencil I don't know I think it says nut bush is the shade uh, it looks like a brown eye pencil which I'm I'm cool with I love you know me I love pencils um, and I know if this is the Amon brand, the Amon brand used to be, I don't know if it's still there. It used to be in Rexall um, and it does cater towards uh, darker skin tone. So check see if that brand is still, still alive. Brands seem to like come and go, but I know if you're looking for um, makeup that caters to uh, deeper skin tones, I'm pretty sure that's what her brand was for. I'm pretty sure it's the Amon brand, um, the supermodel. Okay, so the six products are the Avante Moisturizer, the Masquerade Mask, the Lip Cream, the Balm Blush, the Amani, um, Amon Liner, and then the Neon Drip Palette. So, I mean, that's pretty good. Again, it's like a nice variety of products and it is like a good range. Like it's not all lip or like all eye or whatever. Um, so yeah, kind of a nice range. Let's talk about money. So, so they call this the December 2020 box. So this is like, I guess, December, uh, January. The thing I didn't mention at the beginning is this is a bi-monthly box. So you get it every other month. So there's like December, January, I guess. So now it'll be February, March, and then the next one will be April, May. Um, so that's how it works. So this one was the December, January one. I'm just gonna run down the prices that they say, and I'll have to do the Canadian conversion and the value in total. The palette is $29 US, um, or I could have got a Suva palette, the Saffron palette, which was 35 US. 
The uh, Balm Blush is $21 US. The Avante Skincare, this is where I laugh, um, $132 US. Okay. Um, the liquid, oh, it is a liquid lipstick. Oh yeah, okay, it is drying down. Yay! It's not super, like there's still some color coming off, but it does, um, it's $14 US. And then the liner is $10 US. So I'll add whatever that total is up and I'll put the Canadian values as well on the screen so you know. So again, talking about money, <laughs> this box is more expensive than pretty much any other box I've bought so far. And for us Canadians, it can be a little deceiving for how much this is. So I decided to buy a three box subscription. So that's sort of like a half year subscription. You can get a one box, a three box, or a six box. If you got the six box, that's basically an annual subscription because it's bi-monthly. The website says it's $32 per box for three month, for the three month subscription. Or if you just bought one box at a time, it would be $34.99, $35. That's in US. So when I bought the three month subscription, it ended up coming out too with everything in total, like there's uh, taxes and I think there was shipping as well. It came out to $135.22 US or $177.60 Canadian. So that actually breaks down to $59.20 per box for three months. So it's almost double what you think it is per box. So when you're like at the website, you're like, oh, $32 per box, that's pretty good. Like you, my brain does things like rounds that down. It's like around 30 bucks per month. It ends up being closer to $60 per month when you finally get to the very end of it. So I did want to point that out because that does have a factor for some people. Like I feel like $60 a month, it is bi-monthly. So I think it's not $60 if you're looking at an annual subscription. It's, it is technically $30 a month, um, but the whole box is $60. So it is a bit more pricey than like Ipsy or Top Box or BoxyCharm, especially if you're just getting the base box for BoxyCharm. Um, so I just wanted to point that out there because I think I don't know, as a Canadian, I always find that like, you wanna know what the end price is. Like there's a price on the screen, but then there's like an end price by the time you actually get to the very end, um, which can be a big deterrent for actually purchasing certain things. They also do have a lash subscription on their website, which is pretty cool. And if you go to their website, they actually have some really good deals on right now. Like you, they have like a buy one, get one free sort of thing happening right now. And there's some really good products and some pretty decent deals on there if you are looking. So. I don't know if you need a subscription to buy from their sort of sale, like their regular website. Um, it'd be interesting to know. I haven't tried that out. I should see. But yeah, so I, I don't know. Was this worth $60? Sure, yeah. Like now that I'm looking at it, I would say, like when I think Canadian money, like the palette's like 20 bucks, the blush is probably 15, the lippy is about 10, the eye pencil's about 10. Yeah, like that's probably about $60 worth for me. But am I getting, do I feel like this is like 125 plus value? Maybe not. <laughs> That's how I feel about this. Anyway, so as I mentioned, I got a three month subscription for this. So I do have two more boxes in this uh, Try Beauty box to try out. Um, and I'll let you know how those ones go. I'll do videos for those as well. I just wanted to, again, give this a try and share it. And um, so if you guys are interested in the subscription box, you have a little bit better of a sense of what it's all about. If you like this video, feel free to give it a little thumbs up down below. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my tiny little channel here in Toronto, Canada. I hope you're doing well, and I'll see you sometime soon. Bye.